Okay, so I thought I'd remake a video of the dual zone ream air conditioners at our friend's house. I mean, their house is like a freaking mansion. Um, they're straight cool units, natural gas furnaces. One's in the attic, one's in the crawl space. And I really don't feel like crawling in another attic or crawling under a house today when it's like 30 some degrees outside. And obviously they're not running because it's freaking cold because even the ponds are frozen. But here they are. This one does the upstairs and that one does the downstairs. There's one of the vents for the one under the house and I don't know where the vent for the other one is. But this one is a ream, high efficiency, probably a eight or nine sear at the most. And it was manufactured in 1990. Here's the model number and the serial number. 220 volt, R22. Here's the lines. Electrical. And this one here is um, probably either a four or five ton and it's a Ream Custom High Efficiency. Unfortunately, the model sticker darn faded off. All you can read is Ream Air Conditioner. But these things have, this thing has a beefy compressor. It's a big rusty chunk is a compressor. Just for the heck of it. Let's see if I can find the, see the furnace. There it is. I don't know what brand it is. There's the furnace. The evaporator coil. And that, that furnace is an 80 plus. The one in the attic is a 90 plus. Which I find weird. Yeah, good old reams. Good old suckers. And this one's from this one's older than that one. This one's from the 80s and this one's from the 90s. Cause a three ton and that's a I believe that's a five ton from what I've been told. Anyways, over and out.